How's it going guys? I'm Aaron Baker from Techno Buffalo and CES 2013 is right around the corner, literally, and the focus of this video is smartphones. Let's take a look. So it's no joke when I say CES 2013 is right around the corner. January 6 kicks off one of the largest electronic trade shows in the world. And while there's a ton of stuff we'll see next week in Las Vegas, connected refrigerators, awesome accessories, cool gadgets and more, the focus of this video is on smartphones and three smartphones in particular. These are the three that are rumored for CES 2013. One is the LG Optimus G2. Now this thing is rumored to pack between a 2 and 2.5 gigahertz quad core CPU, 5 to 5.5 inch display. So if you're somebody that doesn't like those big displays, you're going to be kind of out of luck because a lot of these devices have big displays. But to continue on, 13 megapixel camera, 3 gigabytes of RAM, and more. So this thing is going to be a fast mamma jamma. I don't know if people say mamma jamma anymore, but it's going to no. be nobody says that anymore it's gonna be fast that's for sure the rumored zte z7 will compete with larger smartphones such as the htc droid dna and samsung galaxy note 2 and it's said to offer a 5.7 inch 720p hd display 1.2 gigahertz quad core cpu 8 megapixel camera and 3000 milliamp hour battery now htc says theirs is a phablet or is not a phablet rather samsung says theirs is kind of like a tablet phone hybrid We'll see what ZTE says about theirs if they release it. The HTC M7 is the third one that's rumored for CES, and it packs a 1.7 gigahertz quad-core Snapdragon CPU, two gigabytes of RAM, a 4.7 inch full HD 1080p display, a 13 megapixel camera, 2,300 milliamp hour battery, along with LTE and HSPA Plus capability. The trick with all of this is which carriers the devices are gonna to come to. And I found over the years that CES 2013, it's usually more indicative of the devices that are coming to the US as opposed to like a Mobile World Congress where we see the devices released on a more international scope and then come to the US a few months later. This time around, I'd expect to see the HTC device and the LG device both come to the States pretty soon. And then as for the ZTE unit, as of right now, there aren't really any high-end ZTE devices on any carriers in the U.S. So I'd expect to see that stay international unless a random carrier in the U.S. decides to pick it up. On top of the carriers, expect to see tablets take center stage as well with rumors of product announcements from Microsoft, Samsung, Intel, and Barnes & Noble with their Nook product. So a lot to be excited about at CES 2013. We'll be there to cover it live from Las Vegas with a great team of people. In the meantime, hit us up on Facebook, facebook.com slash technobuffalo. Be sure to check out our Instagram feed as well as we post pictures from CES, all the behind the scenes stuff. You wanna see me shooting videos, John shooting videos, Todd doing things, Ralph doing things. Hit us up at instagram.com slash technobuffalo. I'm at Aaron C. Baker on Twitter. The company's at technobuffalo. And we'll see you soon from CES 2013 in Las Vegas. I like that thing. That's useful. It works, right? Yeah, that's really it's useful. It's kind of hard. Yeah.